So here is 20 things, 20 really fun things to do in Forge Horizon 5. Let's get started. Number one. So you can mod your game. For example, this YouTuber, DVS Squad. Now, boys, please don't do this if you care about your Forge Horizon 5 account. Because you will get banned. I'll be honest, Forza, like, shouldn't ban people for modding the game. Like, modding a game should be part of the game. I don't know why they're banning people for modding their game. Number two, you have to spawn over here. So, you're not gonna full send it. You are actually going straight into the jungle. And now, we gotta get some speed. Full send it. And then, two things. First of all, you can try to, oh my god, barrel roll, land on the bridge. What I meant was land on the bridge or jump over here as long as you can. I know the world record is somewhere around 1000 feet. See if you can actually get more than 1000 feet. Number 3. Now this is important for two kinds of people. If you are rich and if you're poor. So everybody, you gotta go into the auction house. If we want money, we wanna get rich fast, right? If you go into Toyota Trueno, what we want is to snipe that car. If I get the car, I'll be able to flip it for 10 times the value at least. Uh, those are the poor people. We're gonna talk about the rich people as well. What if you have like so many credits and you don't need to do this strategy, right? You just, you have so many wheel spins, basically all the cars in the game, except one of the rarest cars in the game. In this case, there are some really rare cars in Forge Horizon 5, which only a few handful of people have. Those cars you can never buy you can you can't buy anywhere else except when someone puts those cars up at the auction house so for example this car the razor ts19 one of the most rarest cars in the whole game and as you can see ryzen is just spamming over here i know for a fact it took him many hours to even like see it pop up uh, like right now it will pop up and you're like oh my god it's happening and he you're trying to buy it out but it failed because somebody was faster than you but yeah good luck trying to get this vehicle boys <laughs> Number four, building a wheelie car. There is one good wheelie vehicle, which is called the 1971 Mayors. Uh, let me see. I might have to tap something to get it to do a wheelie, maybe. Oh, here we go. We had to tap the dude. We had to do a little weird thing over there. It's pretty much infinite wheelies. Just max everything, overdrive, put some thick tires on, you know, to get that grip and trying to drift into a barrier and at one point the nose will go up but that's how you do wheelies boys and look at this my man is just vibing in the car he's just having a good time there next one is play a random blueprint map so what you're gonna do is go into creative hub click on the event lab click event blueprints and click on trending today and some of these maps can be really awesome for example this one this has to be like one of the best city maps in Forge Horizon 5 right there the boats as well. The attention to detail over here is pretty astonishing. Actually getting goosebumps over here. I'm not even kidding. Dude, look at this place. How do you even do that? Oh, and the map is called Port Italy. And in brackets, it says day. If you want this specific map, by the way. Number six. Get on a highway and now get some speed. Every time you pass the AI car, you get to say, no, 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 no. Uh, so yeah, that's something you can do uh, if, you know, you are really bored. Uh, anyway, number seven, host a car meet with your friends. Oh, but Goose, I don't have any friends. Don't worry, there is an easy fix to that. Just go into Fiverr. That's the site where you can uh, uh, buy services. And you can buy a friend over there for only 19 i I'm just kidding. God, I'm just kidding. No, no. Simply open up any 4.5 stream. See who is holding 
car meets right now. Go into the chat, be like, yo, I want to join the car meets. Can you invite me? You'll have more success rate with people with a lower viewer count, by the way. So go out there and make friends. Number eight, the speed warp tunnel. You go over here, search, and over here, you put 139023219, and you press enter, and it says speed warp tunnel. You know what? Since we are going in a tight tunnel, I think I'll whip out my long sausage. Oh no, wait, what? We gotta go up there? Wait, I'm sorry, what? I didn't sign up for this. Okay, let's try at least. Fifth gear. Wait, are we getting there? We might be able to get there. Come on. We're getting so close. We're falling down. Okay. But here is the clip with like a proper car with like a, what is this, Jesco over here? This is what happened. You just go like full speed. It's going 720 miles per hour in this tunnel. Oh, and the tunnel is not endless. At the end, you crash on the ramp and you just fly like crazy uh, across half the map over here. Okay, beautiful. So yeah, this is something you could do. Number nine, become the AI. And you have to pick the most ordinary vehicle you can find in your car list. For example, the silver Jeep. And you are now AI. What you can do, if you guys have friends, and that is a big if, you can turn this into an event. So your other friend would also be in this city and he would try to find you as the fake AI car. And I've actually done this event with a couple of my friends like Ryzen and Y Drops. So this is one of those fun events you can do. Here is a clip of the actual event as well so you can understand what I'm talking about. Where are you? Let me come search with you. I, well, I don't know where I am. I don't have the map enabled. <laughs> No, but you can describe your surrounding area. Okay, all the buildings look the same. There's nobody here. Hold on, someone's in a yellow car? Ryzen, do you have a yellow car? <laughs> yeah, he's lying. He's capping. He went right past me. Number 10. And for this next one, you do need a drift car. Which, by the way, the best drift car in Forza currently is the Challenger RT 1970 Dodge. And I'm going to be using that. But it is the roundabout challenge. Fast travel into this destination. Drift on the roundabout until you fail or you have lost all your brain cells. Very simple. AI will make this challenge pretty difficult as well as these other players which I don't know what they're doing. Are they racing? Okay, he's taking the exit. Yeah, trying to stay on this roundabout for as long as possible. Set up a timer and if you can do this for hours, you have my deepest respect number 11 drag race with your friends and the best place is obviously right over here there is drag races in this game which you can join without any friends as well so no friends needed but they are oh goodness hold on there's a big jump i just want to know how far can we jump pretty far actually we're gonna land on a cactus over here <laughs> But if you do have friends, it's gonna be a lot funnier. So here is a clip of a drag race with me and my friends. No, no. Oi. Bro, I'm gonna get a DNF on a drag race. Are you kidding me? I'm cheating. I don't care, bro. No. Oh, come on. Let me win. White Drops is cheating. He's ramming me. No, I'm just... Bro. <laughs> no. No. No, he's gonna win. Number 12. You go into my horizon over here. Go home. Customize character. And you get... <laughs> And you gotta work on that drip, okay? I don't know why I have a yellow skirt on my boy over here, but you gotta work on the drip. Let's see what I can come up with. Wait, some of these shirts are like 45 grand? That's crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, we got the drip. Check that out. <laughs> this is pretty cursed. Number 13. What you want to do is you want to teleport, I believe, somewhere around over here. Because in this section, there is something really special. And we found it, boys. We found the ass. Now, the legend says if you ran over this ass, you're going to get access to a very exclusive, one-of-a-kind hypercar in Fortress and but we- Oh my god, I was so close! What is the source? 
The source is, trust me, bro. Definitely not made up. Number 14. For this one, you need the fastest car that you have. We need to disable AI completely for this. Now, boys, little secret. If you want to disable AI cars completely from your game, fast travel over here. So reverse a little bit and there should be an event that's going to pop up any second. I think right over here. Yeah, it doesn't matter what event pops up, but you see an event, you have to press enter. You're gonna click solo. Don't worry, it changes your car. Not to worry. The car is just for this event. We're gonna wait until we can quit the event. So just let it roll out. And now the event is starting. Press escape and quit the event. This is very important. And now go into the normal map. You have your Sesto Elemental or whatever car you picked. And if you haven't noticed, there is not gonna be a single AI car now, which is crazy. And now what you can do is just zoom through the full map without having to worry about those annoying AI cars. Look at this. The road is empty. Just send it. Okay, full throttle. You don't have to avoid anybody. I don't know why by default Forza did not have this feature, but uh, yeah, really cool little hack to remove AI traffic from Forza Horizon 5. You're welcome. Number 16. The Drift Challenge. So, this challenge is pretty simple. You drift for as long as you can. As you can see, there is drift points on top of the screen. If you stop drifting, you lose. Now, the world record currently is 121 million. So how hard can it be? I am actually going to attempt this as well. No joke. It's gonna it's gonna be on live stream. You're welcome to check out my Twitch. So if you're really bored and you have a lot of time, get sideways and just let it rip. Number 17. Arab Drift. And if you guys have seen a ramp drift videos, obviously we're gonna need some kind of a lame looking vehicle. Cheap looking vehicle, but it has to be front wheel drive. Guys, I'll be honest, I've never tried drifting a front wheel drive in Forza Horizon 5. So this is gonna be pretty fun. And first attempts. Wait, hold on, we're sideways. Wait, it's working. Okay, we're over steering. Oh god. All right, attempt number two. And just go left and right. This is really hard, boys. And this is pretty much how it is. It's just really hard to control. Yeah, guys, uh, a ramp drift and do it. But you do gotta be better at the game than I am, okay? <laughs> Now, for number 18, one of my favorite things, ladies and gentlemen, a wheel spin drift build. So whatever the wheel spin lands on, I'm gonna have to turn that vehicle into a drift build. I'm so glad it wasn't the off-road car. I'll take the 175 grand. Let's see what we get next. Hopefully it's not an off-road car. We got money. Dude, the BMW M2 would have been so good, by the way. But okay, next spin, surely it is gonna be a banger vehicle. Come on, it's gonna be a good vehicle. No, it's not. It's five grand. But now, surely now. Oh my god, 200 grand. Okay, guys, just. You know what? Wheel spins. Just do wheel spins. They're really entertaining. I love wheel spins. Free money is always good, but now... Oh my god, okay. Okay, well this is... I would have taken the 200 grand to be honest. But basically the challenge now is... The Range Rover Sport 2015. We're gonna have to turn into a drift build. So that's gonna be fun. And don't worry, you don't need to make a drift tune, boys. Somebody has made a drift tune for every single car. These are all drift builds for this vehicle. I don't know why people are drifting with this car, but there are so many to choose from. So we're gonna use rear wheel drive, and hopefully it's good. So we got our 69 mommy wagon over here, and uh, let's get sideways. Okay, hold on. I mean, it is driftable. Let me go with the second gear over here. Yeah, it's definitely driftable, boys. It feels like a heavy beast. I'm kind of doing figure eights over here. But yeah, boys, you can absolutely drift the Range Rover if if you just get a rear wheel drive drift drone. I mean, this is just crazy. <laughs> you can make any car drift in Forza Horizon 5. Number 19. Become a collector. So try to get every car in the game. Rare and common ones, everything. And also, you have to complete all the achievements in the game. But if you're bored, try to get all 137. Number 
number 20. Just uninstall the game and play something new. Like the banana game that has almost 1 million concurrent players right now. Actually, don't boys. It's a scam. It's a scam game. Pretty much a get rich scheme for the developers. But hey. It's working. Number 21. If you're bored, then subscribe right now and like the video because I'm going to be making more awesome Forza content. Peace.